Hey there buddy, I'm Spiracus. Welcome back to the heart of Prague, apparently. I don't know what else this could be. Here in Deus Ex Mankind Divided. So, in the last episode we, you know, um, kind of, sorry, you died. Um, you know, we uncovered this extortion ring over here with these fake policemen over here. And that's fine because, well, we're Interpol and that's basically our job. Now, well, I was smart enough to delete my save file from the last episode. So I had to play all of the stuff that we did in the last episode again. And I think I covered everything, but maybe I didn't. Uh, if we play something again that we already did, I apologize. But for now, can I climb up there? Ooh, you might be able to climb up there, can we? Come on, jump up here, jump up there. Oh yeah, look at that. Can we? Yep. Oh, wow. So we don't need to hack it over here? That's interesting. I'm going to do that in a second. Um, that's not what I wanted to do, actually. Because I already oh took a look around here, and there is a closed terminal over here, or yeah, lock pad. And we're going to do that at some point later, when we can hack it over here. Well, the flowers kind of give it away that this is probably the train station where the a terrorist attack happened. Well, here we have an office for some local government dude and also a locked keypad but also but well, we cannot hack this one not yet at least there's also a safe behind this painting so let us have a look at that and um okay, let's try it now i i by now have figured out again because well um human revolution was so such a long time ago i already forgot how it like how it was but it's basically the same again, so far at least. Um, so I got it. What do we got here? Some credit chip, a pistol. I'm not gonna pick this up for a reason I'm gonna tell you soon. Because I already have a pistol. And um, if we pick this up again, we just we just get the ammo for that, even though that wouldn't be so bad because having some ammo for that wouldn't hurt as much. Anyways, um, but I would like the thing is, if we pick this gun now up, we just get the ammo for it. But if I sell this gun first, for about... I don't know how much I get for it. It's probably not that much, so it's, let's pick it up anyways. But it works for other guns too. Um, you know, if you pick it up you and you have it already, you just get... Um, you know, ammo for it. If you sell it, and you get a lot of money for it, there's also a combat rifle I forgot to pick up. Um, yeah, you, you get a lot more money out of that. You get a lot more money out of that, and that way you can make some nice um, money. Now, the thing is, I wanted to, to see if we actually get some mm, experience points from that. No, I don't think we can do that. Can we? Can we? Can we? And he's pissed us as well. Well, that wasn't smart. Mm, I wanted to actually to check if we get experience points for hacking into this thing, and I think we we do. So um, yeah, this is probably the latter up there is best if you kind of manage to lock yourself out of this thing. This took too long. No, this didn't. Good. Uh, if you kind of manage to like lock this one down, and then you can somehow differently get in there. Anyways, there's always another way to get in, but, um, you know, getting experience points is not the better. All right, now we got some guy. Can we? Of course, we can up here. We can go up here. Now, how do we do this? This guy just come up, comes up. Damn it. I think we can go up here, but I do like to take the direct approach because these guys have guns. And guns means money. Would you like to move? I guess he does. You hear anything? Come on, come on, come on, come on. What? You saw me. God damn it. He saw me. When did you see me? What? I'm probably jumping down. He he heard that. Hmm. Guess that was it. He heard how I, how I fell off that construction thingy. And um Yeah. 
right, let's see if we can. And quick, 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 quick. Access granted. Good. Thank you. Let's do that again. All right, let's save right now. I should really use the quick save option a lot more often. Around here. So crap like this doesn't happen again. Right. What does it say? Ox built your cities. Yeah, you bastards. Stupid um, naturals. Right, let's um, go down here actually. We just have to wait till he moves. Like he doesn't really see us, I think, so we're fine. Like he's already moving. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Ah, oh, damn it. Come here. Get over there. Alright. That worked out just fine. Okay, these guys have shot. Oh, yes, shotguns are good. Because these things sell for, what was it, was it like a um, 700 something a piece? That's a lot. Alright, now my hopes is that this guy sees the other guy sleeping around. Would be awesome and such. Do you do? Do you do that? Ah, yes, you do. You didn't see me. You're the only one suspicious. Damn it! What are we supposed to find? Rats. Wasn't there just some guy over there? I thought I saw one. Damn it, he's now suspicious. Without. Hmm. Okay, let's see if we can do move somewhere differently now. I would like to move further away. The space thingy doesn't work out. Which is a one two. Okay, now he infected the other guy also with suspiciousness. Okay, let's let's sit it out for a while. I think we can do that. All right, come up here. Okay, this was a bit stupid, but like he did, he was suspicious of that guy. Yep, it works. So. Shh. Be quiet. No. What? Damn it. Oh, these other guys are also now. Damn it! All right, unless they see me, I just—I think I'm just gonna skip ahead. Don't think. All right. So, oh, the the search is still not done, but let's see if we can. Now, there should be some other guy over there hiding. Okay, now that the search is done, there's this guy. Does it work? I think it does. This guy's looking suspicious, but he's not doing anything. Come on, come a bit closer. Worst if it is over, Brad. Come closer. Right. Save this one. He saw us, but we still good. We still good. Now there's a machine pistol. I, I have one already. I'm gonna pick this up, I think, off episode. You know, off camera. After... Um, you know, after I continue or edit this episode. Because I, I did the same, um, you know, after the last episode. It works out just fine. You can do that. This, the guys just don't disappear or something. Um, let's just go over there. Let's just see. Wait, wait a second. I didn't see you look over there. <laughs> Um, okay, we could go in here. We could also go up there. That'd be all the way, also way in. Let's try that. Let's go upstairs. I think we have to go upstairs. Now, up. Hmm. Yep. Get open the window. 
Okay, the three guys up here. One is looking at us. So. Yeah, there it is coming up. Come on, come on, come on. Hmm. Okay. Oh, and that's the end. Well, that's not ideal, but rats, rats, rats. Good. Okay. Did one guy go downstairs? Nope. They're all three up, up, up here. Okay, there are two, at least two downstairs. Two are downstairs. Hmm. Let's go over here. Watch his rats. What happened to him? Go fix this. Damn it. Alright, but this works out. Okay. There seems to be two more three downstairs. Asshole. Rats, they're coming up. Go fix this. You don't fix this. Okay, kill two. Happens. Happens. That. Uh, oh, two more. Oh man, that's too many actually. Ooh, that's not good. You see me from down there? Really? How can you see me? Oh, that's how. That's not cool. Up. Let's go down here. Rats. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Right, let's see if we can heal ourselves. We got a couple of beers. So, let's drink some. Actually, let's drink um, this thing. So, so we have uh, the, the slot empty over here. Okay, this worked out. Just fine. Now, the other guy. Did you destroy my cover? I think you did. Rats. Being drunk is not so easy. <laughs> Good. Alright, I think I got it. I didn't want to kill them, but... Um, a thug's life, guys. Thug's life. Okay. Now. Good. Let's put the weapon away. Let's see what we all else also got here. Now, I think we're done over here with the with the map, basically. Yeah, the guys came from over here. We have now. Now, oh, that's level 3. Level 2 and level 1. Uh-huh. I think we're done. I think they all, all just came to me. I really like, you know, how you can see through the scope. It's good, I like it. Time machine. Let's see what you got here. That's the end of it. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Caller, the time machine. Hmm. Here. Let's open this one up. I think it's the same here. Anomaly yeah, that's not good. Trace program initiated. Uh, Access granted. Yeah, Whoa, that was close. Right. Yeah, we get we get a, a little bit of experience points for that. Actually, not that little. Thirty if you get it on your first try. It's actually a bit. All right, I think now we're back. Yeah, now we're back at the in, in the store. So yeah, that's it. There are no, no, no bad guys anymore over here. So some beers. Some more beers. Mm. Oh, hearts. Beer. I like beer. Being drunk is fine. I mean, why else would you not be drunk and start shooting people? Or, you know, start drinking when you're getting shot at? It's like... Basic, you know, like... Uh, Interpol training the first day you you just drink as much as possible so you uh, again don't get so drunk so easy all right um we don't need this then hmm you need to hack this one 
Um, well, this is kind of boring that it's always the same, but oh well. Access granted. Fine by me. You okay, should get also some of that. All right. If you want to read that right now, just do that. I'm going to also read this, but in my own time also. So, um, all right. That's basically it. Yeah, there was just, just a lot of talking and uh, shipments and blah, blah, blah. All right. We have to talk to this guy over here. And he has this like store with the thing. Uh, this bookstore, which is the time machine apparently. We also have one over here. I thought that I saw this one already. With a drawer, which is empty. Another empty drawer. Interesting. Mm, heck it. Alright. You got something. We have to go here first and then go over here. Um, let's try this. Okay, now we have to hurry up. What, really? Minus one? Oh, right. Cool. We cannot be detected there. And now... Wait a second. Oh, there was... Oh. Data store? Directory? Let's see what happens. Okay, I wanted to see what happens if we do this data store here. Anomaly detected. Credits. Oh, nice. Granted. All right. Okay, more stuff about probably, yeah, delivery, that books. Um, congrats. Hello, time machine. Helen's monk, blah, blah, blah. He's talking about some books. All right, so this is his, it's it's his front. The bookstore is his, his front for his basically illegal arc operations, I guess. Um, and um, these mails are from the official one, so basically. All right, now where we have to like find this guy somehow? <laughs> Hello, guy. If you don't show up, I'm gonna mess your shit up here. Seriously, like you had like also a couple of thugs coming after you and I, and I dealt with them so um I think it would be nice a bio cell oh cool <laughs> I just actually oh and some credit chips nice I actually just want to, to grab some stuff and um, you know throw it around yeah this place could use a vacuum look at that mess all right nothing over here we've been there now we could climb up here so let's do that and I think I found the way we have to go. So um, let's look around somewhere else first. Let's look around fiction and drama. All right, let's find some drama. I like some drama because I'm a drama queen. The Miracle of Life. And he got a couple of copies of that. The Miracle of Life also in... Oh, that's the drama section. Is the Miracle... Yeah, the Miracle of Life is also fiction. And it's probably also history. Um, incredible, actually. <laughs> no, 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 it's... You gotta say it's already like filled with a lot of stuff. Um, you cannot really uh, say that the the, the guys. In with what? Oh, that ain't cool. That ain't cool at all. What could we throw away? Nothing really. Hmm. I don't want to throw anything away. Let's. I'm gonna keep pick this one up later when I start selling stuff. Let's go over to the guy that we have to meet. I think it's over here. Yep, looks like it. Looks like it. Hello? Still not there. Well, this looks like your office. I mean, it's the most beautiful part Jensen. in here. Thank God. Hey, Vocalist. I'm down in the dungeon, man. You remember the title of my super secret book, right? Right. Yep. Hmm. Let's look in this one. No, we cannot hack this. Too bad, all right. Okay, there it is. The super secret book. What's what's the title of the book, actually? The Fallacy of Divinity. Sure. Ooh, nice ox. Can I get some? Apparently not. Mm, let's go downstairs to the workshop. 
Of course it's downstairs because, you know, um, that's where the stuff is. Yeah. All right. Which is that? Some formula or something. I cannot open this. Yeah. Cool. Get some, some, um, you know, get a hand. <laughs> you need Jensen, to lend me a hand. <laughs> my favorite <techno> <laughs> Quite guy. literal. Sorry about the goons, man. They, uh, they didn't give you too much trouble, did they? They're not going to be a problem anymore. What do they want? You behind on your protection money? I... I don't think it's about money. I got this little misunderstanding with their boss, Otar. Misunderstanding, huh? You know how it is with these gangster types. Sure. Enough to know that there's no such thing as a little misunderstanding. <laughs> yeah, exactly. The Valley internal politics. I... I'm going to get it sorted. Going to see the big boss myself. As soon as things settle down, the day after a bombing, man, it's... Well, I mean, it's scary, right? I'm surprised people go out at all. Sometimes people don't have a choice. My systems took a hit. I was hoping you could help me get everything running again. Took a hit? You mean... Oh, shit! Why didn't you say so? We need to get you in the chair. The chair. The chair. You know, I've always wanted to get a closer look at those sadie fogs of yours. A real close look. Yeah, don't, so, get, don't get gay uh, on me, man. So let's strap you in, get the gas going, and then, well, then I just need to sort of dive in. Huh? Feel my way around. Yeah, you, you get super gay on me, but you don't really want to do that, man. You probably wouldn't survive that. <laughs> yeah, um, how about those thugs? Hang on a sec, you're gonna put me under for how long? What if the Diwali send reinforcements? Oh, you're just stalling. Those illiterates aren't going to get in here. Don't be scared of the chair, okay? The chair. The chair is The gentle, chair. I promise. This thing with the Diwali is nothing. Otar's pissing where he shouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> I count on you to fix me, Kohler. To some extent, your problems are my problems. To some extent. That's sweet, Jensen. Otar Botkoveli is the Diwali number two guy. The men outside, they were his men. But the big boss man is Radic Nikolatse. He is the number one guy. And I know Radic, so... So don't worry about it. Now... Are we gonna do this procedure or Dude. what? I mean, you got a bit of a red eye, so um, let's say if you were like if you were under the let's say influence, um, I, I'm not sure if I want to, like, um, <laughs> yeah, you know, sedate me for a while and work on me, what operate exactly on me. What exactly are you gonna do to me? Yeah, I'm not sure yet. First, Great. I got to get in there to see what's wrong, but don't worry. I'm not gonna do anything to you I wouldn't do to myself. I promise. Well, that's not really Besides, promising, actually. you've been here a few times. You know I'm professional. I'm pretty sure he's doing a lot of stuff himself that I wouldn't do to myself. You never had to put me under before. <laughs> I never saw you the day after an explosion before either. That was a big shock to your system, man. Kaboom! Boom. Now, you want me to fix you or not? Sure. Go ahead. <sighs> All right. Let's just get this over with. Relax, Jensen. It's... it's gonna be fine. You... you won't even know I'm in there. You'll feel weightless, far away, like you're someone else. But Kohler's gonna bring you back and make you you again. Before you know it. Alright. Good night. Ooh, yeah, I could need a... Nap, you know. What? Oh, thank God. Uh, take it easy. I swear I didn't mean to. Your retinal display should be back soon. You can still move, huh? Where, where did you? I was. I was trying to connect the unconnected. What? But you got some strange fucking ogs back there. Uh, I mean, I, I probably shouldn't have. Uh, here, let me get you some water. Or something stronger, maybe? Water. You got it, Jensen. Just, uh, just ease up. Okay, don't freak out. 
Rebooting was the only way to save you. Save me from what, Carlos? Rebooting? Cool, down. You almost melted my chair. The chair. I you, and I found these... These, uh... I think it's better if I show you what I found. Bring up your system display. You need to see this for yourself. You need, you think that, your you need to see this cliche. You're familiar <laughs> with all these, right? Yeah. Basically. David Seraf installed them. It took two years for my body to get used to everything. Right. Well, I had to undo some of that getting used to. What's hey, where's my practice go? Why do I feel different? I had to practice. Something was trying to vampire the juice out of you. I couldn't figure out what <laughs> until after the reboot. Turns out your factory zero is not the standard factory zero. What am I looking at? Experimental fucking test dogs, man. Hidden inside your body. You're telling me I got more implants than I thought I did? More than your body can handle. Pretty cool, right? I'm not sure yet. I want to show you what happens when you <laughs> activate one of these suckers. All right, hover the mouse, click one. What do we got? The peps? Nice. Remote hacking? Seems to be also a nice thing. Um, Tesla. I'm a fan of Tesla. Nanoblades. Because killing them normally is, I think, too normal. Icarus Dash. Yeah. It's okay, Jensen. Fox Enhancement. One isn't that, gonna kill that's you. nice. I You've think Titan. Yeah, that looks awesome. Um, but I don't really, like, expect me to use that a lot because I want to sneak around a bit more. So let's do, let's do the Paps thingy. Um, or or the remote remote hacking. All right. Oh, now we have the two practices for some some reason. Okay, fine. Let's buy it. It's fine. Okay. See that major spike in your power consumption. Where the hell did these things come from? Press X to hack. That, that can't be it. All I know is the explosion must have woken them up. But man, you want to use these crazy fucking things? That's your right. We just gotta make sure it doesn't fry you. Now I think I maybe got an idea on how to do that. Try yeah. shutting down one of your other implants. You know, just for fun. Okay. Escape. Now. Deactivate, so I can. Go ahead, Jensen. Shut shut down well, this I don't have it, so I can using. just shut it See down. That? Cooled you right mm. down. You have the power to balance. You know that's a really awesome one. Just. Thingy. You know, don't activate everything all at once. What would happen if I did? Well, you'd yeah. suffer some major glitches due to overheating. We're talking risk of permanent damage. So, you know, maybe don't do that. All right. Reset me now, Kohler. I'll reactivate what I need myself. Yep. It's fine. Good. Thank you. So, we done now? No? No. Okay. We're not done. So I'm not always going to be there for you like this. I can't just follow you around to reset things and hold your neural weave together. Whatever choices you make from here on out, they're your choices. I thought you were supposed to be my AUG expert. Yeah. I specialize in Chinese black market, okay? The shit I found hidden inside you, spliced into your system <laughs> like that, looks to me like it's from Mars, man. So you're incompetent, huh? Yeah, that's sure what it is. From Mars. I just, I feel bad. You deserve answers I can't give you. I can help manage your system better than anyone in Prague. They help you make the most of the new augs we just found. So? But you can't tell me where the hell they came from. As far as I know, David Seraph installed all my augs. There's something inside me I don't know about. He's the one I need to talk to. I am familiar with Saris' work. These new augs, they... they look different to me. I mean, that neodymium shell. Who uses dimorphic magnetoreological fluid like that? Seriously, if you talk to Sarif, you need to ask him that. Shit really stands out. Pretty fucking cool, actually. All right. Why would Sarif have hidden these things inside me? I don't get it. I don't either. I'm not convinced this is a Sarif job. The tech itself is super high end, but the PDOT insulation, sloppy. The bone mounting mounted on the quick just doesn't have Sarif's touch. Looks more like a retrofit to me. Something much more recent. 
Bob, what are you thinking? I'm thinking how much I hate being unconscious. You said these additions look recent. How recent? Within the last two years, give or take. Something happened to you in that time? I was pulled out of the ocean and put in some facility in Alaska to recover. It was a few months there that... The more I try to remember, the blurrier it gets. Shit, Jensen. That's terrifying. Right. Okay. You ever seen anything like this before? An AUG system that's deliberately hidden like that? I don't know, Jensen. I mean, I heard of people getting the black market treatment before. Pass out in Prague, wake up in Shanghai. <laughs> but usually they wake up with less AUGs, not more. <laughs> yeah, that's what a good exactly one. What exactly makes these AUGs so different from my other ones? They look like experiments, is what? Loose wiring everywhere, man. It's, it's like half of you is uh, untested, unfinished, unbelievable. It's, it's beautiful, is what it is. Great. Okay, let's continue. This tune-up went longer than I expected. Let's yeah, wrap this basically. Up. Right. Here, take some Praxis kits for the trouble. Oh, yeah, Praxis thank you. Praxis solves everything. Keeps customers happy. Just uh, remember what I showed you about managing your juice. It's going to be a balancing act for you. Well, unless... Unless what? what? Just tell it. <laughs> there could be a way to optimize. It's just... It would involve getting something from Otar. Okay. I don't care. Just, just tell me. There's a way for me to use everything I have without compromise. I want to know about it. Yep. I was hoping you'd say that. I order all my fancy tech from this illegal catalog, right? <laughs> but... My last shipment got intercepted. By Otar Botkoveli. Illegal catalog. The same Otar awesome. whose men were looking for books out there before? I am not going to force you. I want you to want to do it. I want you to want to be an augmented god among men. If that sounds like something that interests you, a then bit, you yes, know yes. that Otar runs an underground casino in the Chisti district. The entrance is in a small courtyard off Hlavni Street. Thanks for the info, Kohler. Thanks for the praxis. Okay, but new practice available to new. Oh, oh, 12 practice. That is nice. Um, now I think like I, we didn't really get practice kits like in here, but um, actually like actually practice like right in here already. So that's fine. All right. So we're going to distribute that in the next episode. Thank you guys for watching. I'm going to take a cut in here and then I hope to see you in the next episode where we, you know, test out these orcs. I'll see you then. Bye-bye.